this is going to sound super obvious after I after I say it. Mm. It'll sound super obvious after I say it. And it'll be like, duh. But I want you to think about, do you actually ever think about this day in and day out? But when it comes to yourself, when you look at you, you are always a whip. Okay? What do I mean? You're always work in progress, right? Except you don't think about yourself that way and you don't think about me that way. So what do I mean? Just as an example. All right, so I sit here today in front of you, right? Some of you might have just found me this morning. Some of you might have been following me for a few years. But I look to you like finished product, right? Here he is. He's giving you a talk on his beliefs and, and so on. And I look like a finished product. And even what I'm presenting to you looks like a finished product. But nothing could be further from the truth, right? I am constantly in a state of change and evolution. And when, when, whenever we create something in our lives, as we go through the creation of what we want to accomplish or what we want to tackle, I have news for you. The masterpiece never looks like a masterpiece when you're in the middle of it, right? The surgeon, as she stands over the patient whose tummy she has ripped open, looking down, that masterpiece doesn't look like a masterpiece during the middle of the operation, right? It isn't until the, the, the great big smile on the patient's face when he's all healed that it becomes a masterpiece. And so, so, so think about that. You, when, when you're in the middle of something, it's never going to look like a masterpiece. And that includes you. Uh, it includes anything you develop, right? That, that book is not going to look like a, like a masterpiece inside Microsoft Word, right? And, and, and so when, 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 you're, when you're going through and you're actually creating I, I, I have a line out there, a today's line to live by. Uh, if you follow me on the social media sites, you know, I put these out every morning at 7 a.m. And one of them is the plagiarizer never sees the invisible work that makes the masterpiece the masterpiece. Right? It isn't. Somebody will. I can almost say that with certainty. Take this talk I'm giving today, copy the seven points, and then go make a talk of their own. Right? From the seven points. But... They never see all the work that went into creating the talk or the book or the paper or the project or the system or the whatever. It certainly didn't happen this week, right? This is 55 years being manufactured and, 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 and harnessed into 20 or 30 minutes to deliver it to you. But the plagiarizer can never see that. But one, one extension of that, yourself, rem remember, and I, I wrote this one out for you. As you want to create something in your life, and the masterpiece will never look like a masterpiece during the process, but for you, the work internally is what makes the masterpiece the masterpiece. It's the journey. For everybody else, it's the finished product at the snapshot at a moment in time, and maybe it lives forever or maybe it evolves. But a masterpiece can never be a masterpiece unless it benefits somebody else. And it cannot benefit somebody else unless the thing is breathing. So you need to be able to create it and get it out into this world. And if you're hemming and hawing and afraid about its receipt, you're going to have to get over that. So I want you to have a bias for action. I want you to have a bias for action. And the tip is, if you can get your mindset wrapped around creating MVPs, minimum viable prototypes or minimum viable products, whatever it is that you want to call this. But spend the least amount of time and the least amount of money getting something livable and breathable out into this world. Now, it could be a training course like I give to you or a talk or it could be a white paper you write or it could be a process that your team uses. But I always say you can't scale version zero, but you can scale the heck out of version 1.0. Okay, I have, I have things out there four years old. They're still in version 1.0. And I have some things that are in version 1.3 and some 2.0 and some that are in version 15.7. So, but 
this bias for action will keep you in motion and the and what else will this do it'll give you momentum right and once things are produced it's going to make you happy and you can work with it and you won't know if it's a masterpiece until you get it living and breathing and what'll happen is the people who are using it will help you make it a better masterpiece and they'll get value out of it